Plus, we are in countdown mode as NASA and SpaceX prepare to launch the next group of astronauts from the Space Coast. If all goes according to plan, Crew 2 will be in orbit this time tomorrow. Good afternoon. Thanks for joining us. I'm Justin Warman. I'm Bridget Ellison, and here's a live look at the Falcon 9 rocket sitting on historic pad 39A at the Kennedy Space Center. Launch is set for 549 tomorrow morning. News 6's Mark Lehman is on the Space Coast, where big crowds are expected for launch day. For tomorrow's launch, officials expect the prime viewing locations to fill up very quickly. One of the most popular spots is here next to Port Canaveral. This is where we found people already making plans and camping out in anticipation of liftoff. We're, we're pretty excited. Mm -hmm. yeah. Carrie Fountain and her son Lincoln say they can't wait. It is amazing. I think that the space travel is it's so cool to be able to witness it firsthand. Her family securing a spot for their RV in Jetty Park, which will be packed with families early tomorrow morning, all hoping to catch a glimpse of the rocket set to lift off at 549 AM. We already planned that we're going to set our alarm for 5 o'clock, and we may end up climbing up on the back of the RV so that we have a, a view right over the top. Officials say there could be more than 200,000 people coming into Brevard County for the Crew 2 launch. That includes Shannon Hoyt and her family. We drove over here to um, see the rocket launch and have a couple days of learning about space. It'll be a first time experience for all. Hoyt says she'll be using this as a learning tool for her children who will have the opportunity to witness history firsthand. Just have fun with it and enjoy it. It's a once in a lifetime thing. Now, when it comes to traffic for tomorrow, things are expected to be busy, but definitely not as many cars on the road. If this were an afternoon launch, drivers are being asked to follow electronic signs for both pre and post launch traffic in Brevard County. Mark Lehman getting results. New six. Mark, thank you. Our live team coverage starts tomorrow at 4 a.m. here on News 6. We'll also have you covered all day from all the angles on ClickOrlando.com.